oh, hello, I have a Timu haul for you. <laughs> so let's get this done. I forgot what I got, uh, but I'm going to show you what I have. Pardon me, I'm a little itchy. And then um, I will uh, write in the description, uh, I will write the description and the prices for everything. So I imagine this is more on the crafty side, but let's pull her out. <laughs> okay. Oh, and my hair, I, I work at a school and I've been going in and out. We have really bad rain here in California, Southern California. And um, I had to go inside and outside of classrooms and stuff. So I still have my rainy hair. I just got off work a little bit ago. Okay, so our first one, Oh, I got some fun stuff in here. Again, I told you it's a Timu haul, right? Right, okay. Oh, this is cute. I remember getting this. I don't know if I'm gonna keep this for myself, but it is a little coin purse. Isn't that lovely? It had to have cost me maybe $3 or less. I like it, the colors in the flowers. And you open it up. Oh, and it's beautiful inside too. And look at all that room. I thought this would be good to put in a backpack, like if I go to a uh, garage sailing or, um, you know, flea market, whatever. Uh, this would be good to put your change and your and your dollars and stuff in and um, open it up and say how much. Oh, six dollars. Okay, here you go. <laughs> anyway, so there's that. I need a new socks to slip into my sketcher shoes. But I don't, no, 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 no. Take that back. I need socks for my Skechers shoes, but these are not for my Skechers shoes. I don't know why I bought these. Maybe to, oh, I know why. Um, I have a thing about if I put my feet in slippers and I feel um, like a, a piece of sand or if I feel something funky in it, I, I can't get over it. It's like lying in my bed and if I feel a little bolly ball or something in my sheets, I'm done. I can't sleep on it. I'll sleep on a towel. Anyway, so I think I got these little slip-on slipper thingies. I bought these to put into slippers or my little um, house shoes. So yeah, so they're just little like, oh, and they're non-skid, which is nice too. So anyway, got a pack of those. I believe this is loungewear. I love loungewear. I, am, I don't go out anymore, really. We don't go, we may go occasionally go out to dinner, but parties, um, social events, we really don't go to, but I do love my loungewear. So um, I have, I like to buy clothes for loungewear because I stay home a lot. Anyway, so I bought these pants. They feel, it's like a sweater material. Look at that. And I like this when I go play games with my girlfriends. I just wear this kind of clothes. Sorry, I'm looking out the window. I thought I saw somebody. Anyway, so here's this. There's the pants. See, it's like a little, what do you call it? Ribbed right there. And then here's the top. I like this, the um, short sleeves. I don't like to be too hot. So anyway, this is a two-piece lounge wear. And um, I can't wait to put it on. All right. What else did we get? Hmm. I need to lose weight before I buy clothes. I'm buying all these big clothes from Timu just to make sure that they fit me, but I'm also trying to work my way back to Weight Watchers and stuff like that. I shouldn't be buying clothes, to just to tell you that. Okay, so I bought the, the loungewear in black, and I also got it in this color. So once again, I'm excited. And you know what? It's not bad. It doesn't look... I could wear this to the grocery store. I could put some tennies on or some slippers and... Um, or my cracks with some socks and um I can go to the store with that too and sorry gosh my hair is just so ew anyway I'm almost done this is a small haul so I told you that I'm interested in punch needling so I've been buying kits to practice on and here is one that I am going to start today Look at that. That is going to be pretty. Let me take this out here for you. And so it shows you, it gives you the punch needle, the little thread thingy, the yarn, all that fun stuff. And um, once again, this is the design that I'm going to do. So I can't wait for that. And then I want to make, once I start learning the groove of punch needling, I want to um, 
turn them into coasters. I really like making coasters and trivets. So there you have it. And this is, I don't know. <laughs> hmm. What did I get this for? I don't even know what it is. What is this called? It's a black mat, but for what? Hmm. Pardon me for not remembering what this is for. I don't know. So, <laughs> okay. But this one I remember getting. This is a mat for the bathroom. We have these mats that kind of stand up a little bit and um, hard to describe. Anyway, the bottom of them gets, you know how the mats get, like the red icky sticky stuff on the bottoms and all that? Well, I don't like that. And then I was seeing previews for a, a mat kind of like this one. Ooh, you'll make it hard to open. <coughs> anyway, this is the mat. <laughs> my scissors are in the other room <laughs> with my craft stuff. I should put them back where they belong, right there. Anyway, they say that this mat, bathtub, bathroom mat, should be um, better for you. Anyway, I'm not going to sit here and try to open this in front of you. But yeah, it's got little, not loofah-y, but it looks like loofah, but it feels like it's a different material. Anyway, so this is a mat for the bathroom. And um, there's one more thing. Oh, a couple more things. Okay. So I bought this little brush for when I bathe my dog, Harlow. God, why am I suffering? I should pre-open pre all this stuff, but I had to do this because my husband left for a walk. And I just don't, I feel funny when um, he's home. And sometimes if I don't say I'm recording, I'll be talking. What? Ah, go, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> anyway, so this is to clean your dog, your animal. You put their soap in here and then uh, you hold it like you can hold it. I guess you hold it. Wait. Dun, 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 dun. Like this. So there's a little grip thingy and you just scrub your doggy. So I bought that for Halo. And I thought, oh, they look like they were glass. I never read the fine print on the material. These kind of look vintage to me. I'm going to pull them out. These are like little hooks. Look at this. Doesn't this look like something you would see like in the 60s or 70s? Here you go. What these are, um, they are hooks. You just hook, you put them on your, it's got adhesive or it's got a sticker here. Hopefully it's good quality. But anyway, and then you hook it. I thought I would hook it in the bathroom to hang like a, um, you know, tank top or whatever on. So anyway, and I know that these were reasonably priced. So I thought these were pretty. And last but not least, I do have another package coming, but I don't know where it is. I mean, when it's coming, but I'm sure it's soon. I keep looking outside. I can see my friends coming down the hill. There's a street that goes up, and sometimes when I see them, I'm like, oh, there they are. All right, anyway, I just... So this is a greeting card. I think I decided, oh, okay. This is a birthday card for my brother in October. I'm not gonna put it, I don't think he watches my videos much, but okay, I got this because it says something really nice and lovely on it. And I already have two of his birthday gifts for his birthday this year in October. So I'm planning ahead for everybody. I, I feel that way is better and who knows, due to my car getting, my truck getting crashed into, I probably have car payments on the way. So do I get another job to do that? Or do I, everything will work out. Everything will be fine. And you have to remember that. The older I get and all of the challenges that we have had, I am now learning to accept things for today because worrying about it, Stressing over it will do nothing for you in this moment. Sometimes you can't help it, but um, 
anyway, there's it's out of my hands right now. It's I just got to wait for the insurance company. Thankfully, I have my husband's car, but he's going out of town next week. So I have to figure out how I'm going to get to work and stuff. And I have a doctor appointment in Laguna Beach. So I'm going to need a vehicle. And maybe, hopefully, um, I will, a rental car, you know, the, the, the company will kick in. Anyway, so that's it. That's all I have for you today. And um, thank you for stopping by. And if you want to hang out with me a little bit more, I'm quirky, I'm squirky, I'm... Look -er -loo -loo -loo. I'm turning into my mother and I'm pretty happy about that. She was so, I don't know. She was just a wonderful woman. But um, yeah, anyway, so let's uh, move forward. Let's focus. Have a most wonderful day and uh, believe in yourself. And please um, tell your friends about me, you know, if you want to say, hey, there's this weird old lady redhead gal and um, she likes to do Timu hauls and stuff. And she does them because she she buys mostly gifts for people. But sometimes she buys things for her house and um, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, and I, I like to buy these things cause just to show you what these stores have. So I mainly do Timu hauls. Um, I don't do them a lot. And the Dollar Tree, which I don't do a lot because I just don't need, really need to go shopping. But um, that's it. And I'm going to try not to say, um, a lot. Um, okay. So carry on, have a most wonderful day and we'll see you later. Okay. Bye.